thank you uh, for your patience. Thank you for your cooperation tonight. As you know, it's been a difficult evening for our organization. A couple of updates. There is no change in status to our deputy. Uh, he's still in life support. Circumstances are dire. His family is with him, and we are praying for him. I want to extend my gratitude before I give you the update that we're going to provide uh, to the law enforcement community. All of our colleagues from the state and federal level, local levels, have been exceptional partners in this difficult evening uh, in assisting our search and helping us with the crime scene with every aspect of this. So I think it's important to recognize the hard work of these men and women. As for the suspect in this case, at about 6.30 this evening, we received a call of a shooting in the Tonopah area. The shooting took place between a homeowner and our suspect. There was a history of some conflict. He went to that home tonight. There was an exchange of gunfire. We had deputies and tactical units in the immediate area. They were able to locate the suspect not too far away. He had been struck by the gunfire and was transported to the hospital where he is in critical condition. That investigation is fluid and ongoing, but it is with a sense of relief that I express to you, I'm glad to know that he is off of our streets. I cannot give you a status on his condition because I do not know it. Again, I want to thank you. I'm not going to be answering any questions tonight. I know it's difficult for you, but I promise you, our media team, as we gather more facts and have more information, will be available to you tomorrow morning to make sure that we get cl clarity to the community. But I also want to express the support that we receive from a lot of community members um, through Facebook and social network and other uh, mediums. So thank you very much. God bless. Get some rest because hopefully some of our deputies will get some rest tonight also. But we have a lot of work ahead of us. Thank you.